Hey guys, Lamsi here. Welcome back to ATS. We're continuing our journey. If you remembered from the previous episode, we were supposedly doing like a 300 mile journey from Lakeview to Medford and we were supposed to pass through 97 here but when we came around this intersection, we found a detour, a new thing as of 1.33 and we couldn't pass through it so we had to circle all the way around here so a 250 mile journey become like became like a 500 mile journey and we are like halfway done so we'll finish the job this time even if we're late even if we don't earn anything and even if we don't see anything any of our loads anyway but we'll, we'll still finish it because we're we're like starting we're like finishing things that we started it's good oh is the rain over Rain is over, I think. Finally. Good. And of course, we still have EVR sounds. Where are the wood panels? Good question. We call this the Emperor's Loads. <laughs> the Emperor's Load? <laughs> okay. Yeah, weather is turning up now, thankfully. So now we can get to admire more. The snow all around us. What have you been doing, Rohan? Did you go to the gym or something? So when does Christmas break start for you guys? I, th I remember Patrick said he was like done with the finals, so he has his own break already. How about for the others? When does Christmas break usually start? For me, Christmas break starts as of Saturday. I'll be flying back to Manila then. And then I'll be returning 2nd of January. Lots of things planned in Manila. Have to catch up on a lot of adulting stuff. But at the same time, lots of reunions. Christmas is uh, definitely the biggest holiday in the Philippines. It's like the Thanksgiving <clears throat> for those of you in the US. Although in, in an hour flight to Manila, you have to like go... So normally it's Singapore to Manila, a straight four hour trip. But because the prices the ticket prices are so expensive we had to pass through Malaysia <laughs> to lessen the price a bit it's still expensive but not as much we spend a couple of more hours on the trip but at least we save a few hundred bucks I think it's worth it did I just say you were bullying? yes I did That's your typical behavior. <laughs> Can you set the nav satna for minor roads only? Uh, yes, Chi. What are you trying to test out? Because let's see. Um, you're wondering if it would fix this? Gym. You went to the gym. Phew. That's good. I haven't been to the gym in quite a few days. So busy, but later, later is non-negotiable. I have had enough of work. Christmas is not a big thing in India. I can imagine. Yes, yeah. You already had your holidays. Uh, what is what is it called? Diwali, Deepavali. There you go. Thanks a lot, Alex. That's the right link. Christmas is fake news. Well, you could have different matters of it, but it's a tradition now. And uh, reunions, I look forward to them in a way. Especially with the closer relatives. So to me, it's not really about the authenticity of the thing. Although, of course, I believe that it's authentic. But for me, it's more of the 
that it brings together people at least once in a year just finished your religious festival make the diversions more challenging Ooh. because the diversions are more on the highways right? so if you pick small roads you would get less of them is that are we on the same page or did you mean it differently you've been behind on sleep as well yeah you need all the sleep you can get you're a growing kid and you will for sure miss all your nap times when you get to a to the working environment you will regret that you didn't sleep more Diwali in Kartik Purnima Ooh, that one I don't know Yeah, this is this is what they said is difficult with driving on snow Especially when the snow gets thicker You don't see the road markings anymore Because of course the snow is piling on top So it's kind of hard to see if you're still on your lane And that makes it more dangerous overall You might be crossing over to the other side if you're not estimating it correctly at least that's what's been told to me. That's what's been told to me. I haven't experienced it myself yet. I see. <laughs> you mean Santa Claus isn't real? Oh, he's real. He's real. Or maybe not. We'll see tomorrow if he's real. Wink, wink. This is so nice. I love the reflections. The reflections on the road. That looks so real, isn't it? Your job registering on the VT log live, but your mine's not. Hmm. How are you making trying to make the deal but more difficult? Ah okay, it's different uh, train of thought. Mine is not. Well in ETS I had to remove VT log when I was sneaking about with Beyond the Baltic Sea. But in here, in ATS, it should be logging properly. I think. Santa is fake. Well, uh, you might be proven otherwise tomorrow. We will see. We will see. <laughs> Have you seen the most recent video by the Norwegian trucker with the new Scania S? Of him having to drive in mountainous ice roads with lesser trucks getting stuck. Oh, really? No, I haven't seen it. I think I've seen a thumbnail. I think it popped up on my feed, but I haven't watched it yet. My goodness, I love this. Super texture roads. Makes it more exciting. Very nice. Job registered at least on Discord. Ah, cool. Which job? Because we haven't finished the job yet for this stream. <laughs> because of that pesky detour. showing on yours in ATS. Hmm, I'm not sure why. IRL trucking skills far exceed what you can do in game. <laughs> I can imagine, yeah. I've seen him, I think, I've seen a video of him, I think, in the... going through like some very narrow roads, side by side with trucks. Yeah, that seemed very scary to me. I think that you sh you shared that one as well, and that's why one I checked out. Our bolly on you. Why? What did we do? <laughs> There's live log now in VT log. Ah, the live log. Yes, that one I have disabled. Yeah, that one I didn't install at all. I only installed the tracker because. Uh, before it was causing a bit of lag on some people i think rob was getting like a lot of lag there and then when he disabled it it went fine so just to be on the safe side i also disabled it anything that could potentially cause lag mm, i'm not sure if it if for ets2 it's updated i would think so but yeah i haven't tried it because we were checking out beyond the baltic sea and we were checking out Trejun, 
and uh, I didn't like to like change the scenery of what was originally planned for them but yeah I think it would fit very well huh not yet uh, it's too bad I guess it must be a lot of work having to transform the entire asset list of uh, the Baltics but yeah this one is so good even if it's just if it was just the roads I would be happy enough but everything is else is just oh my goodness love it as I mentioned I can almost almost feel the cold getting very windy in here let me slow down a bit Fortunately, you're experiencing no noticeable lag in so far in ATS ATS. Yeah, maybe I think it has been fixed since I just forgot to install it Maybe when I install the new VT log Which comes this Friday you guys have to update otherwise your jobs won't get logged anymore Maybe I installed the live tracker as well That would be nice Oh, only for 1.32. That's too bad Up, 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 up. Huge stutter there from an unknown source. Need to do one more job on the old VT log. Is that for the thousand delivery achievement? Goodness, I should get a trophy for that. ETA 66 miles. We're almost there. And we're super late. I doubt we're, we'll earn anything here. Maybe spare change. For an even 1,000. <laughs> Cannot even imagine a thousand jobs. <laughs> Amazing. And that's already including those thousand kilometer journeys, right? Oh, yeah. Does it show like your total mileage for all your jobs? I wonder if you've like gone around the world already or how many times you've gone around the world if you base it on the distance. So we have like oh bouncy. We have like a frosty winter mod changing the roads, the trees, the grass, the ground. And then we have foggy weather for the beautiful skyboxes and somehow they kind of merge, right? They kind of provide a very... still a winter feel. Doesn't feel too sunny. Feels a bit cold. It's nice. Holiday pay rates. What pay rate? <laughs> yeah, I, I increase like... Uh, oh! <laughs> the past just worked. The, the 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 nice sound pass momos no no it's momo meatballs meatballs pass thingy the LG washing machine yeah I give like a three hundred percent increased pay during holidays but because the base pay is zero <laughs> yeah. It used to show total mileage, but the new VT log doesn't. Oh man, yeah, that must be like, I don't know, could it be in the millions for you already? <laughs> Maybe not that much, but it'd be close enough. Hey, Cascade, good evening. Thank you for dropping by. How are you? Off from the weekend to the next weekend too. Nice. Enjoy. <laughs> yes. Enjoy, are you going somewhere? Just uh, chilling out. So you don't have Christmas, but do people like often go on holiday still during the end of the year? Is it more like an end of the year celebration? I think you want out on the VTC. <laughs> the company period sounds like a scam. Of course not. We always always have pay increase. We have like 30% pay increase every month. 
you won't get that anywhere else. Just don't ask about the base rate and we're fine. Ah, oh, suffering through migraine. Hope you feel better, man. Thank you for dropping by, I really appreciate it. Wait, this is a nice, uh... Oh, no! <laughs> was there a traffic light? I think there was. I completely ignored it. I thought it was like a, a normal ramp. Family function. Enjoy. Uh, now, how do we take a photo here? Have a good night, Cascade. Hope you feel better. And uh, happy holidays. In case we don't catch each other till then. My goodness, that's a very nice intersection, huh? Is this new in Oregon? That's a very exciting intersection. Although this guy is blocking my view. Hmm. I guess we could do it like that. Yeah, that can work. Just remove the blur. That can work. He jumped the light. <laughs> yeah, that's definitely a part of it. Even if it, there was no crash. <laughs> it's close enough. The invisible cargo saved you. <laughs> yeah. I think so. We would have gotten like a near miss achievement in there. Okay, move right, please. Thank you. You'll work on clumsy moments in the break. Oh, that's amazing, man. Appreciate it. Thank you. Hope you enjoy. <laughs> We're excited to see what you'll come up with. I'm trying to hear more about the the engine sound. If I look up, it goes stronger. <laughs> Strange. For some reason, this looks different. I'm not sure if the dashboard is from NFSHP. I think... Maybe not. Because I remember it looked a bit different there. This might be the standard one, huh? Not sure. Intro. Yeah. Sure, go ahead. get it from YouTube <laughs> the font is the luckiest guy you can download it from almost anywhere it's a very common font I would say he need it from me oh you want to send the actual video with the intro yeah sure thing Hmm, how can I send it though? Wait a minute. Are the flares also updated in ATS? Maybe it is, huh? Because I, I saw the reflection in the trailer, it looked very nice. I'm not so sure now, it just doesn't have the fading fade out. Oh, it does! It does have it. Okay, I just didn't notice. Yeah, new flares definitely. Yeah, I was noticing because those orange lights looked very different. I like it. the actual intro. The flares are updated, thanks. thanks. Yeah, that makes sense now. We're here, finally. Uh, we don't normally do convoys. Not yet, at least. Because uh, my schedule is crap. <laughs> but I'm, I'm more than happy if you like, if someone organizes it and whatnot. Yeah, at this point, though, we haven't done so much of that yet. I think we've only done a convoy once.
Yeah. Headlight fade in, fade out is there. Yeah, there you go. Sometimes it's not though. It's fading out, but it's not fading in. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Yeah, we, we are a very mod-oriented community. I think most of the guys here play with mods. So going to MP is like cutting off one hand. <laughs> so not a lot of convoys happening. That's a very good point. I'm out. I'm out starting next week, starting Saturday. This is why we're doing the live recording sessions now. Yes, exactly. But you guys can do it. I can watch. Like, I don't know, maybe Jay or Jack can stream. I can drop by. Yes, you can also get it from YouTube actually, the intro. The same way you would get all those clumsy moments. Alright. Enjoy Sheng. Catch you next time. Tomorrow. For those who are in Twitch. We will be having a... Christmas special stream. And for those in YouTube. When will this show? Yeah, it will be coming on Christmas. For those watching this on YouTube, you will be seeing the Christmas special on actual Christmas Day. I don't know yet what we'll be doing, but I do have one game for sure planned in there, and Jay might be happy with that. <laughs> That's as much as I would say. But yeah, I'm planning to make it like a, a chill, as always, a chill stream. Just trying out different games, enjoying. We can do either multiplayer or some funky games. Maybe we can have giveaways, I don't know. Depends on my budget, but we will see. So, make sure you join. Oh, come on, park it already. We're too late already as it is. I guess that will still fly. I'm not sure if it will accept that. I think it's too far. Oh, it it is accepted. Good. <laughs> Maybe it's saying you're not lo you're not carrying anything anyway. <laughs> Might as well Might as well get this done and over with. <laughs> Scotsman heard the magic word. <laughs> More chill than the winter mod. <laughs> will we have Santa Clumsy? We'll see tomorrow. We'll see tomorrow. Oh, we did earn like half. Okay, that's not too bad. I was expecting like zero earnings totally. Please exclude Scotsman from the giveaway. <laughs> Some salty comments in there. Yeah. So, finally finished that episode. Next one. The one coming out next week we'll probably be exploring Mexico Extreme a bit yes we'll see because it is compatible with 1.33 as well but till then that's going to be it for now thank you for watching guys in YouTube clumsy trucking I'll catch you in the next one I'll go inside so it's not as loud there you go have a good one. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up, hit the like button, comment, share, and everything. All that stuff. Catch you in the next episode, and bye-bye.